Hello fellow travelers, today I'm going to be talking about socks, specifically women's wool socks for travel. I'm going to compare four different brands and tell you how well they stacked up against each other. Welcome to Jane Sees the World. We're just a couple of average gals who love to explore and see the world. We are part-time travelers with full-time jobs, so we have to make the most out of our vacation days. If that sounds familiar to you, go ahead and subscribe. But for now, let's talk about socks. Let's take a moment and talk about wool. If you are not traveling with wool, well, it's time to get on it, quite honestly. It will change the way you travel. Cotton has nothing on wool. It wicks, it keeps you warm, it keeps you cool, it dries fast, it comes in all different weights. There are some really great brands out there, so get on the wool bandwagon. For this experiment, I tried four different brands of wool socks. Uh, basically, I wore them till they started to stink. I used them in my workouts and then I kept track of how long I could go with each pair before it really started to smell bad. I wanted to see which one would go the distance. First up were these lovely little icebreakers. I am a huge fan of icebreaker. I've been wearing it for over a decade now. It's a great brand, a great product, and it has never let me down. This experiment included, I was able to wear the icebreaker socks eight times before they started to get a little grimy. Um, which is fantastic. It was pretty much what I expected in terms of longevity. I do wash my socks more often than that, but it was nice to know that in a pinch they would go that far. Uh, the disadvantage to Icebreaker is that it's spendy. I think it is worth it, um, but you might have to make an investment. And it is, can be a little difficult to find sales, although you usually can on like Steep and Cheap or Sierra Trading Post, places like that. Also, Icebreaker comes in lots of great options. We have little thin ones like this, little thick ones. These are quite thick. Longer thick ones. And these are just adorable long, but quite thin. They're great. Up next, I went with a Smart Wool. Uh, Smart Wool is a great brand. A lot of uh, hikers, backpack enthusiasts, outdoor enthusiasts, and travelers use Smart Wool. Uh, like Icebreaker, there are lots of weights and lots of cute cute shapes. Um, they also tend to be a bit on the pricey side as well, but I have found with Smart Wool that you can find them on sale more often, in my opinion. So not uh, a little bit easier to find. Uh, this one lasted six wears before it started to smell. So definitely worthy. I mean, if you took two on a two week trip, you'd be fine. Smart Wool. Up next is this adorable pair of Pendleton. Uh, I love Pendleton. I love their blankets. I love the colors. I love that they're a company, family-owned company in the Northwest. I love everything about them. I have to be honest though, these socks were a bit of a disappointment. They only lasted four times before they started to smell, yet the price point is comparable to Smart Wool or Icebreaker, so you're just not going to get the value in terms of how long they'll last. However, they are adorable, they're cute, it's a great company. So if those are your main objectives, then Pendleton's great. Last was these pair of wigwams. I'd never heard of this brand. I picked it up at my local department store for about maybe less than half of what I would pay for a pair of icebreaker. They turned out to be what you pay for is what you get. They only lasted about three times before they started to smell, which isn't much more than a pair of cotton socks would go. So I think you're better off to invest in something a little nicer uh, but if you are pinched for money or time uh, you can pick one of these up and still still probably get by it's just not what I would recommend for long-term travel so there you have it the four brands of wool socks women's wool socks that I compared for travel icebreaker came out on top which is not entirely surprising but smart wool is very close behind that and a worthy brand it might take some time uh, getting all the socks that you want. Uh, they are a bit of an investment to get a good pair. I recommend that you start though. They will make travel easier and they'll be a good piece of gear to have on down the road. If you like this video, please like it, subscribe, comment, tell us what your favorite socks are.